I want to pivot to your book. No, no pun intended. So rules of the rubber, rubber ball. First of all, there's so many stories in that, you know, find and sustain your life's work, right? First of all, I love the fact that you, people told you no. And that ESPN is like, you know what, this like makes so much sense. And it's still in alignment. That's another word. So I gave you one adjective, curious. I think the other word for you is alignment. And it's so important for success because when you're aligned, you know, if you look at the history of your life, you did this, you were in the Air Force, but you were a trainer, right? Because you wanted to do it. When you asked to be a trainer in the Air Force, they said, no, you're like, but I'm still going to do this on the side because I love it. And then you happen to do it for, for a school and the Philadelphia 76 to see you like, <laughs> because you were so passionate and you had alignment and you didn't step away because it didn't pay you. You didn't stop doing it. Yeah. Right. And so there's one thing in your book that I love and it's chapter six, expect the unexpected. Mm. Who the hell expected <laughs> this? Tell me how that book makes this time in our lives relevant. Well, that, th- that rule expected, I always like to throw in there and respect the unexpected. Oh, like that. Right. And so, yep. How are you showing up and being present so that you can see these opportunities, these unexpected moments? And I think we have to first and foremost decide to be present. 